is Arika Misha, and y'all know it's time to do some cooking and then eating afterwards. Hey, y'all. All right, so y'all see I got my slow cooker here, my pressure cooker here. Um, I love this thing. I just throw the food in it, set my timer, and go do something else I need to do. So that's what we're doing today, y'all. And today we are cooking. I've been craving, so y'all know how that goes. Sometimes I be craving stuff, my churn be craving stuff, then I fix it. So anyway, I've been craving some homemade curry chicken. So I do have here my curry drumsticks. And y'all know I'm bringing it in for y'all. Ooh, that smells so good. Mm, mm, mm. Some curry drumsticks. Ooh, look at all that goodness. Look at all that goodness make you wanna go cook some curry chicken. I'm finna cook some. So, all right, y'all. I got the curry chicken already. And I have here some leftover um, mula pasta. You know, like the uh, spaghetti pasta. This is the pot size thin spaghetti uh, pasta. So, I really like the uh, pot size. So, that way I ain't got to break it up. But what we're going to do, y'all see what we're going to do. So, we're going to have some um, curry chicken. And I'm going to um, curry the pasta. I put some curry juice on the pasta to make it like a curry pasta. Oh, this is going to be good, y'all. That sounds good. I know it sounds good. Don't say it don't sound good because I know it do, y'all. Anyway, all right. So that's what we're cooking today. We are cooking curry le chicken over le curry le pasta. Pasta. Whatever. All right, y'all. Let go. Okay, guys. I am back. And so you guys see my pressure cooker. I put in three cups of water. Three cups of water doing it different uh, I put three cups of water in there I'm gonna go ahead and start layering my uh, seasoned chicken I want to put that first layer in there and I just I'm just layering it this way so that all the chicken isn't on top of each other so put a couple pieces in there at the bottom All right, that's looking good in there. All right, and then I'm gonna put my little thingamabob that came with, I don't know what they call this y'all, but anyway. Um, put my little thingamabob in there so that I can put the second layer in there. All right, so make sure I get this in here right. Okay, so I got that, that in there right. Okay, so I got that in there. And then I'm gonna go ahead and add my second layer of chicken. Let me see if I can show y'all. Lift y'all up and show y'all. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, so y'all see how I got that first layer in there. Alright, so the first layer in there. Okay. Okay, so we got our first layer in there. Alright, so we'll go ahead and get this second layer in here. And like I said, I'm doing it this way so we make sure... Um, while it's cooking the chicken is separated and everybody gets cooked properly so you know to put space between the chicken y'all know what I'm talking about so we're gonna get this second layer in here get it all nice and packed in there nothing like some good old homemade curry chicken get that in there okay all right, we got that. All right, I got about one or two more pieces to put in here. Let me see where I'm gonna put that at. Okay. All right, because we want to make sure everybody got everybody got their own space to cook. Everybody got their own space to cook. All right, so we got it in there. I got everything in there nicely layered. Y'all see? Y'all see? Let me wash my hands real quick. Okay. All right, you all see how it's all nicely laid in there. Let me pick y'all back up so y'all can see how it's all nicely layered in there. That's our second layer. And like I said, one thing I love about the pressure cooker, pressure cooker, you just cut it on, it's gonna get it done for you. So now, see how I got these leftover juices in here? I'm just gonna put a little bit of water in there. Swish it around. Swish it around like that so I can get all my stuff I pay for, all my seasons. And I'm just going to pour it over the chicken, just like that. Pour it over your chicken. 
you know, just giving it a little sprinkle, sprinkle. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead, let me get my top on. I'm gonna set this to 40 minutes. That should be plenty of time. Make sure my um, cap is on seal. Make sure it's on sealed, closed up. All right, let me get, get this top on, child. This top be acting crazy sometimes. As many times as I've done this, this top still drives me crazy. All right, so you get that bitty 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 bitty. Yep, yeah, that's how you know. And also, in the front of your um, the front of your pressure cooker lets you know uh, that it's closed all the way too. So we got that nicely closed. All right, so I'm gonna do manual. I'm doing 40 minutes. Yes, and then I'm hitting start. And that's it. We leave it alone. Pressure builds up. And it cooks the food 40 minutes i got 40 minutes to go do something else i'll go ahead and just cook the pasta get that ready so all right y'all you know what this is a quick easy meal too quick easy meal it's not it's not something that's going to take all day so we got the chicken in our pressure cooker we already set that to a 40 minute timer like i said you can go do something else i'm already washing y'all hit the washing machine i'm already washing um i can go ahead and cook this pasta real quick so that can be waiting um, yeah, you could be doing all kinds of stuff. Clean and doing other stuff you need to do. Oh, you know what? Just sitting your behind down. <laughs> That's, you know what? I'm going to make that the word of the day. Sometimes we need to just sit our behinds down and get some rest. I'm telling you, I know from personal experience. I just be going, 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 going. And then God be like, girl, you need to sit down. Get some rest. You got to sit down and rest your body sometimes. We got to replenish. Sit down, rest. Lay down, get a nap or something. Rest your body, rest your mind, rest your spirit, rest. Word of the day, make sure you're getting some rest for your own peace of mind. All right, y'all, I'll be back. Okay, guys, I'm back. Our timer went off, and I wanted to let you guys know I cooked it in the beginning for 30 minutes, and then I had to cook it an additional 30 minutes. So it was a, my time was a, an hour. So it ended up being an hour for the chicken, probably because I got a lot of chicken in here. So, all right, and that looks amazing. Y'all know I gotta pick y'all up and show y'all. Oh yeah, that looks delicious. I cook curry chicken on my channel quite a few times. So, it don't matter. I'm just filming what I cook. So. All right, oh, that looks good. So what I'm gonna do, I got my little turkey baster thing. Y'all know, let's pick up the juices. So I got my pasta right here. I'm gonna go ahead and suction up some of this curry juice. Ooh wee, smells amazing. And I'm just gonna drop it in on my pasta. Y'all see that? Just dropping it in on the pasta. Let me get a little bit more. Just gonna drop it in on that pasta. You see? And just gonna mix it up in my pasta. Just to, you know, give the pasta some of that curry juice flavor. Oh yeah. That looks good. I think I need to add a little bit more juice though. A little bit more of the curry juice though. Let me see. Yeah, I need a little bit more juice on there. Actually, a lot more. Oh, whoa. Shooting the juice everywhere. Calm down. All right. I think we got enough juice. I think it just got through sending curry juice everywhere. Okay. All right. That looks good. That looks yummy. See, all I'm doing is just adding some of the curry juice from our chicken and just adding it to our pasta. Mmm, that looks so good, y'all. It looks so good. All right, and let me taste it. Y'all know I gotta taste it. Okay. That's good. Y'all know I got to add the parsley. Don't do that. Y'all know I got to add parsley to this pasta. Gotta add the parsley. Okay, that tastes good. It just tastes like a like a pasta with curry, you know, curry flavor. 
just toss that around. You know, parsley gonna make it look all fancy. All fancy. Okay. All right, that's looking good. Pasta looking good, y'all. Looking delicious. And of course, I'm gonna put a little bit more parsley. A little bit more parsley on top like that. Yes. And there you go. Y'all got your parsley, your curry flavor uh, pasta. Easy, easy, easy. All right, so that's how I did that. Let me go ahead. I wanna pull this chicken out. Let me scoop this over. Oh, let me get me get my Instapot unplugged. Okay, let's unplug that. Cause <laughs> let me unplug that. All right, let me move this over. Get my plate here. Wipe that off, cause curry juice went flying everywhere. All right, now let's go ahead and get our chicken pulled out. I wanted y'all to see how it looked as I pull it out. Yes. All right. Okay, y'all can see. Let me get y'all up a little bit. All right. Let's get the chicken out. Now, you know our chicken is all nice, juicy, and tender, so we got to be careful. We don't want our chicken to fall apart. Oh. Oh, yeah. Let's get all our chicken out. Oh, that's good. It's so soft. It's like trying to fall off the bones. Oh, yes. Y'all see it. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, that's good. That's good, y'all. And I'm cooking some banana bread, too. My daughter wanted me to cook banana bread again. They love my banana bread. Buckle of chicken. Ooh, it's so juicy. It don't know what to do. The chicken's so juicy, it don't know what to do. Oh, let me put that down, because that plate getting heavy. All right, let me put y'all down there so y'all can see. You all can see the chicken. Zoom y'all in a little bit. Yes. All right. Get the top layer chicken out. Y'all see what it's doing. Y'all see. You all see what it's doing. Curry chicken Florida style. Let me get this out of here. Woo, ha, ha, ha. Okay. All right. Now we getting down to the nitty gritty. Yeah, it's just that bottom layer of chicken. Mmm, 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 y'all. This a whole pack of drumsticks. Whole pack of family size. Ooh, that's hot. Ooh, y'all look at that little piece of chicken right there. Y'all think, yeah, I think it want me to taste it. I think that's what it want. It's hot. Ooh, hot. ASMR. Ooh, A-S-M-O-R-A. <laughs> Ooh, child. Ooh, that's good and juicy. Y'all look at that. Ooh-wee. That's hot. Mmm, 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 mmm. I'm got some good eating right now. Mmm, good eating right now. Mmm. Amazing. Mmm, mmm, mmm. I'm, I'm still pulling that chicken. Mmm. Nice and juicy. Curry chicken over the pasta. Ooh, this chicken just falling apart in there, y'all. It's just falling, falling apart. Y'all see the chicken? Now y'all look at, look at, look at how that chicken just, look at that chicken just falling off the bone. Ooh wee! That's that Instapot for you. That Instapot had a meat falling from the bone. Have a hot too, so you gotta be careful. Mm, 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 mm. Y'all see that? Mm. So good. Mm, 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 mm. Eat that other bit. Oh, that's hot. Hot, hot, hot. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm okay. I'm right, y'all. Okay. All right, okay. Ooh-wee. That's some good eating right there. Mm, that's hot. You ain't got nothing left in there but juice and a piece of meat that I'm gonna eat. All right, y'all. Hold on, y'all know we gotta put. Y'all know we gotta put some parsley on this chicken. Don't do that. Ooh, look at that. 
Look how the posh just make it look so fancy. So fancy. All right, y'all. We bring it up for y'all to see. Hold on, y'all. Bring y'all up so y'all can see the curry chicken. Ooh, it's nice and hot. Look at that. Ooh, look at that curry chicken. Yes. Mm, mm, mm. So good. Y'all see the smoke? I just took it out the Instapot. It's nice and hot. All right. All right, y'all seen me do it. So you know I did it. This is Arika Misha. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social media at Arika Misha. And don't forget, guys, that knowledge is power. Thanks, guys. Bye.